Hello, I'm Yang, a neurosurgeon. Today I'm talking about PCV chemotherapy. PCV is composed of procarbazine, CCNU, and vincristine. This combination was introduced in 1970s and has been treated for patients with brain cancer for several decades. The cycle of PCV chemotherapy includes CCNU on day 1, procarbazine from day 8 to day 21, and Vincristine is administered on day 8 and day 28. We should pay attention to avoiding high tyramine foods. I will explain it later. On day 1, patient takes CCNU, so called Lomorstin. CCNU is blue capsule. The dosage of CCNU is 110 mg per body surface area. However, the doses can be different from hospital to hospital. We calculate with this equation. Do not chew. Please take it before bed. Patient take procarbazine from day 8 to day 21. Procarbazine is white capsule. The dosage of procarbazine is 60 mg per body surface area. I recommend patient take it before bed. The issue of CCNU and procarbazine is side effects. Some patients complain of headache, nausea, or vomiting. It can give rise to hepatic, renal, and hepatologic problems. Therefore, regular blood test is mandatory. Vincristin is administered via intravenous route on day 8 and day 28. It takes about 30 minutes to be injected. We pay attention to phlebitis. Vincristin has also several side effects. The most difficult is peripheral neuropathy for patient. We should know about tyramine. When taken with tyramine-rich food, procarbazine can cause very dangerous reactions such as sudden high blood pressure. Do not eat food having a high tyramine content. The figure shows food rich in tyramine. In summary, PCB chemotherapy schedule has CCN on day 1, vincristin on day 8, procarbazine from day 8 to day 21. On day 28, vincristin is injected. The second cycle could be begun soon following completion of the first cycle. We hope this presentation helped patient and their family understand PCV chemotherapy. Thank you.